So it's, it's cool to see, you know, one of the things that uh, um, I saw on your comment back to him was that like you have kind of paused your life to support me mm -hmm. in this and I couldn't be more grateful. And I wondered what, what you meant by that. Like what were some of the things that you guys were go dealing with? Yeah, yeah. So uh, he took time off of school and so did I. So we both have to go back to Utah after this and finish our last year of school and even with work. So he um, sells security systems. So he works a lot during the summers and goes out. So kind of this whole summer, he hasn't been able to work much. And so he's just been wow. home every single day supporting me, running the YouTube. And so it's just been kind of crazy with how things have gone and, you know, having it postponed for a whole nother year. Like we were only expecting, you know, not even a year for this right. comeback. So everything's just been crazy, but I don't know how he's done it. He's just been, he's been amazing. So. Uh, do you talk about a comeback too? Like, girl, <laughs> girl, <laughs> blow it up. <laughs> Uh, it's cool. Well, tell, so tell me more about the, the YouTube. Like, is it the behind the yeah. scenes journey? Is it like your opportunity to connect people with like the work yeah. that goes into creating mm -hmm. these kinds of, uh, inc I mean, it's incredible what you ladies do. It really is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I've always wanted to start a YouTube channel. Oh, okay. And when I was in college, that's kind of, when, when Jonas and I were dating, he's like, you really should start it. And I was like, you know, this is just too much to deal with when I'm trying to do school and compete every single weekend. So once we got married and moved to Arizona, we're like, this is the perfect time to start the YouTube, mm -hmm. you know, Olympics to Tokyo, yep. so or the road to Tokyo. So that's kind of where it all started. And I just really wanted to show people what it is like to be an athlete and kind of, you know, show them the behind the scenes of what a lot of people don't get to see because on social media, they kind of see, you know, the other the side highlight. and it's fake, mm -hmm. you know, you don't, they don't really get to know us personally and kind of what it takes to get there. So that's what I really wanted to do. And I think it's been really awesome to show people that we aren't perfect. Right. So. And, and like, but also beasts. Yes. At what yes. We like <laughs> to muster that kind of courage, right? to muster that kind of energy. Lot. Is the vault one of the most terrifying things? Uh, not for me. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. No. I mean, because I feel I like. Vault. No? No. I feel like it's pretty easy. feel like it's pretty easy. <laughs> I just feel like I'm flying. Oh, no, you flying. <laughs> At breakneck speed, you flying. It's, it's just cool to me because I feel like, you know, we joked the last time I saw you, mm -hmm. also dodging helicopters. Yes, yeah. That, you know, you were the grandma, they called you the grandma mm -hmm. on the team. And now, grandma's sitting here with a silver medal. <laughs> Who would have thought this old lady could do that? What? <laughs> so cool. Like, it's so cool. I know. And so, That's like, awesome. now, you know, talk about a, like a, an emotional swing at the Olympics. How are you feeling? Do you feel like job well done? Do you feel like mission accomplished yeah, in some I ways? Yeah, I feel like, you know, even though I went out there and gave my best routines, I kind of felt like I still had unfinished business. Like, yes, I hit the best of my ability, but I was like, you know, my dream was always to take home an Olympic medal. So mm -hmm. I think this was definitely that icing on the cake and I, I can mean, check it off. So my unfinished business is now finished. So it's what a way to end a career. So wow. just super honored. This is wow. awesome. Wow, what a story also. So cool. What a story. Who plays you in the movie? Who plays you? You asked me this. I, I know. Don't know. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta sort <laughs> we that gotta out. We gotta come up with someone. Is good. it Kristen Bell? No. Anyone? <laughs> is it not? Maybe Kristen Bell. I see Kristen Bell. I see her because she's got like a lot of. She's got a lot of spunk. She's got uh, a lot of attitude. Right. She's a, you know. She's also like. I'm feeling it. Down Maybe. for anything. I don't know. I okay. feel like I don't know. I, I right. see it. I see it. I okay. see it. You said you asked me that already. Next movie, we'll we'll test them out. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Okay, so you know it's just been announced that uh, Simone is going to stick around mm -hmm. for the beam. She's strong and on the beam. This is a, a like the last performance though mm -hmm. at this Olympics. You guys are roommates. Where where do you think her head is at? How do you think she's yeah. feeling? What's what mm -hmm. are you? Yeah, I've been talking to her every day, and you know she's been getting a lot more confident in herself. She's been working a new beam dismount. So she isn't going to be doing, you know, twisting, which is really good. And she says she's feeling really confident. Okay. So I'm just really excited to see her go out there and be able to do something. You know, right. like after day after day kind of watching her, like she's been so supportive and so positive. But I'm like, that's got to hurt on the inside. Like I know she wants to be out there. Right. So I'm just so happy for her. I'm thrilled. So I really hope she can go out there and medal on beam. Exactly, It'd be right? Amazing. Wouldn't that be amazing? Her. To come back and at least do something after everything she's been through, it would be awesome. Okay, so I don't know if you know this, but she's got these two incredible dogs. Mm -hmm. And we know they can't be here, yeah. <laughs> yeah. right? And uh, while, they, while, the, while our crew uh, does a little something-something, 
Um, while our crew does a little something, something. Y'all have really turned out this Olympics on a whole nother level. Uh, one, of your, one of the other Team USA gold medal carrying mm -hmm. gymnasts. Carrie yeah. coming through with the, I was like, and the floor, her floor routine. It was on. On. It was on, that's like, what she needed. Like it was, I feel like at every point, like every time she crossed, I was like, mm -hmm. oh God, here we, and was, she would go through the air. Yeah. Like, it's, and like then she'd land and go back into the air. I was like, this is insane. It was horrible watching. I was like, I can't watch, I can't watch. So I that was definitely a comeback, especially after Vault. Like that was really hard to watch what happened. And so I was just like, Jade, you gotta, you know, clear it out, clear your mind, stay focused. You mm -hmm. got floor tomorrow, you can do this. So that was really awesome to see her turn around and freaking nail that floor team to the best of her ability. I mean, that was nailed. awesome. I mean, so nailed happy it. for her. Yeah. Nailed it. I, it, to it's me, insane. it was kind of under, like, uh, that's it, she won. Yep. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that girl yep. won. She yep. won. She did. It's crazy. So, was there a moment where you guys had a conversation and she was like, I think, I think I'm gonna do mm -hmm. beam, I think I'm gonna do it? Yeah. Um, I mean, I think more leading up to it, it was definitely for sure. I mean, I feel like last night was like, she's like, I'm ready for this. I feel like I can do this dismount and I feel really prepared. So I think last night was like the night she knew that she was going to be ready to go in and step in and do this. So, um, you know, I think every day she's kind of, you know, thought Beam was going to be the one. Mm -hmm. But I think last night for sure was definitely when she was like, this is the moment. So. How awesome so, will it be? It's kind of crazy her. to you know have to wait that long too, like not knowing. You well, know, I'm well, like because that's my question that's to hard. to you guys also. Like, is how is it to have that kind of day right? by day? How is it gonna go? How it's will hard. it be? It's hard. I'm like, yeah. Like, what do I do? Like, even for me for vault, I'm like, is it happening? Is it not? Is it happening? Is it not? So it's kind of hard to have that mindset, you know. So mm -hmm. I'm sure she's going through a lot of different emotions with that. So I'm glad that she's made the decision. She knows what she's doing. So hopefully she can. Forget about everything else, right. really just focus in focus on beam. Focus yeah. on beam. Yeah. Okay, speaking of focusing in on beam, you know. Oh my gosh, stop, that's cute. Listen, so we're thinking, hear me out. Hear me out. Okay. Hear. So you know she loves her <laughs> Frenchies. Yes. Oh, I mean, yes. loves them. Loves them, yeah. We got Lilo and Rambo That here. is so cute. So we thought we'd be in the, in the crowd, like, Ah, yeah. Ah, right? But it's also oh, beam. My gosh. So like she needs to focus. Kay. So we're thinking we're gonna be like Yes, yes, yes. Silence. Right? But working. But we're <laughs> <laughs> silence? Well, I mean I feel like I feel off. like before you know, kind of before she goes, mm -hmm. she needs it. Right? And then kind of let her focus and then Go ham at the end. Okay, so here's what, big. here's what we want to do. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay. So Susan's gonna take a photo of us okay. with Lilo and Rambo. Okay. Right? She's gonna mm -hmm. send that photo to you. Okay. You just show her. Okay. At some point. All right. Listen, they're here with you. You got this. Okay. Right? Yep. And then Easy. we're gonna take them with us tomorrow okay. to watch the competition. Okay. And we're not gonna show them until she dismounts. Okay. Until she dismounts. Because okay. we don't want to like. Distract, got it. Distract. Yep. Mm -hmm. But as soon as she dismounts, we're going to be like, okay. they're like. Ah! Throw it to the crowd. Throw it to the Sorry. crowd. <laughs> I literally just, there are, there are about five other reporters on their balconies and I just streamed through all of their live shots. <laughs> I'm so sorry. You're going to make history. Right? Okay. Okay. Okay, hold on, one more, one more, one more, one more. <laughs> How cute is that? Okay, sweet. Oh, that's awesome. Was that my, wait, did so I put cute. a shadow on Michaela's face? Who, whose idea okay. was this? It was, it was, um, it was, a team effort. It was, I'm gonna be honest with you, it was someone genius. Hmm. Someone genius. So you? You? No, you no, God. Oh. <laughs> no, no, this was definitely not me. Someone that's genius. That's cute. Here's my question for you, like, how are you celebrating? Are you Um. When you get home last to your night, husband. Last night they ordered sushi. I don't really like sushi. Like, I can do a little bit of sushi. Yeah, you were looking for pizza yeah, the last yeah. time I saw and you. Yeah, and so she ordered me pizza and french fries when I came back. Simone did, so that was awesome. She orders you pizza she and french fries She ordered me pizza and hotel. french fries, yeah. That's so sweet. I know, right? That is a good I know. friend. She's a good friend. I'm okay. sad.